we're at the site of our 2013 uh, annual tank rehabilitation project, and this is the stead number one tank where we're doing uh, most of the work this year. Um, part of the things we're doing are, uh, number one is upgrading the tank to bring it up to current standards as far as safety and access, which includes uh, a second roof patch, safety railing on the roof. Um, we're doing a little bit of site work to improve the grading. Um, Improving some of the uh, other appurtenances, like uh, uh, we have an existing vault on the outside that we're going to remove and replace because it's uh, in very bad shape. We're adding a uh, pressure transducer into the new vault also so we can automate the pressure readings and get more reliable readings that way. Um, when all the work to the outside and the inside is done as far as new appurtenances, appurtenances we're going to blast and recoat the tank both on the inside and outside. Um, that's pretty common on our rehabs. Uh, usually the tank coatings last about 15, 20 years in there, maybe 25 on a, on a good tank, and we're, we're due for another uh, fresh coat of paint. So we're going to do that. Um, it's a three-quarter million gallon tank, so it's one of our smaller tanks, so the work isn't taking quite as long as it would for some of the bigger tanks that we've done in previous years. We're also fortunate that we have stead number two tank right next door here. Uh, which allows us to still operate the system very similar to um, having both tanks online because we have that, that capacity uh, in the system. So, uh, we just finished blasting the interior of the tank, so uh, the, the interior coating will probably proceed in the next few weeks or so. That'll take uh, a couple of weeks or so, and then they'll move on to the outside of the tank and uh, wrap things up. You know, it's a 90-foot diameter tank. It's about 16 feet tall, so there's a lot of surface area. Um, we have some rust on the inside. We have some areas where the paint is still adhering very well. So some of those areas take a little bit of effort to blast that coating and blast that rust off. So the blasting takes probably, it took about two weeks for this tank, and the coating will probably take another another two weeks or so to finish that. Uh, some of it is new sand, some of it is sand that's been recovered after the blast, which has to be hauled off. So, but, but yes, this is all, this is all blast media here, yeah.